In this video we're going to look at how to change the colours of the little side bits of the topic boxes in your Moodle course. It is a good idea before you start that you make one box highlighted and one box hidden. That way you can edit the colours of those at the same time as you're editing the colour of the usual unhighlighted and unhidden topic box. Open up the Firebug extension for Firefox, use the inspect element, and when the blue outline has outlined a topic box, click. I'm going to scroll down until I can find somewhere where a background colour has been set, and here I can see that the background colour looks like it might match the background colour of that topic box. To see whether it is the same, I'm going to change it to red. And indeed, that does appear to be the background colour for the usual unhighlighted, unhidden topic boxes. So in my style sheet, I'm going to look for Course Content Main for those topic boxes. I'm going to use the inspect element again and this time I'm going to click on the highlighted topic. Here I can see this colour matches. And if I change that to yellow, that confirms that that is how the highlighted topic gets changed. And I'm going to look out in my style sheet for course content, current. Now the last one I'm going to click on is the hidden one. And this says course content, hidden and the sides have been made white. In order to distinguish them from the rest of the topic boxes. So if I want to change anything to do with the hidden topic, then I just need to look for course content hidden in my style sheet. I'm going to go to my style sheet. I'm going to do a quick search for course content and I can see here course content content. That is the content in the middle of the topic box. You probably want to leave that white. But these are the other three that I was looking at before. Course Content Main, Course Content Current, and Course Content Hidden. So I can now change those to what I want them to be. And I think I'll leave Course Content Hidden how it is. Save that, return to my course, refresh, and now I can see that those changes have been applied.